The grief seems unending for Georgetown County family. Unprecedented rain and flooding has caused their loved one's funeral to be put on hold. News 2's Rebecca Collette has more. It feels really impossible to say goodbye to 26-year-old Erica Wilder. I even asked them to let me, you know, cover her and just let me hold her hand. Erica was so severely wounded from a wreck on Highway 41, family couldn't see her before she was cremated. It doesn't feel real until you see them, until you feel them, until you get to hug them and tell them bye. This is the place the Wilder family finally said goodbye. The sanctuary at First Baptist Church in Georgetown. Erica Wilder died in a head-on collision with a log truck on October 2nd. You don't expect someone to be so young and, you know, a child just comes to show that you don't know what tomorrow brings. Her six-year-old son, Michael, was in the car. God knew that he couldn't take one without the other because Erica wouldn't have been able to live if Michael wouldn't have lived. And Erica was 13 weeks pregnant. I lost one nephew. I lost a possible niece or nephew. We don't even know. Jessica's son lost his best friend. I just felt like I wanted to wake up. I just wanted the dream to be over. Severe weather forced the family to push back the funeral three times. Family finally made it from out of town, though the reality of what happened along Highway 41 hasn't set in. That was Rebecca Collette reporting. A best friend of Erica has set up a GoFundMe account to help with funeral costs. You can find a link to that on our website, countonto.com.